Hey film shooters, Michael Rosso here, and I'm holding in my hands a uh, mid 20th century Revere 8 movie camera. Uh, this is a wind up movie camera. That works. And recently, the Film Photography Project store started carrying brand new black and white what's known as double eight film. It's movie film. What is it? And how does it fit in this little camera? Well, I'm going to show you by sacrificing a roll of 1962 expired Kodachrome film. Now, you may see double eight or regular eight Kodachrome film on eBay. The process to develop this film uh, ceased to exist in the year 2010. So there's no processing on the planet Earth for this film. So I, I don't feel really bad about using it as a demo. Uh, also, yes, you can use Kodachrome as a black and white film, but quite frankly, this film is so old. Ask not what your country can do for you ask what you can do for your country. So if you find a movie camera that is an 8 camera, you will know if this film will work in it by simply opening the back or side of the camera. And here we have it, a very simple camera compartment that takes essentially 25 foot rolls of 16 millimeter double perf film. It's not, it's not your standard 16 millimeter film uh, the sprockets are different and that's why it's called double eight because the film there is the film the Kodachrome film the film is 16 millimeter but the sprockets are standard regular eight millimeter so what will happen is you will load this film in your camera this will be your take up spool right here and then when you're done shooting the 25 feet you will pick this you'll pick up your film take the empty roll empty you will take the empty spool out take the film you just shot flip it and then shoot it again. It says right here, film when on this spool is only half exposed. So here's the thing. So here's your film. It's an eight millimeter camera. So you're essentially shooting half of the width of the film. You will flip it, shoot the other half, and then when you send this in for processing, the lab will develop this film, then slit the film, and then splice the two pieces together so you wind up with a 50-foot roll of developed movie film. And that 50-foot roll of developed movie film will look like this, which you may have seen in your lifetime. So you have 16 millimeter in width, 8 millimeter film, follow this, you shoot it twice, send it out for processing, the lab develops it, slits it, and then assembles it onto a 50 foot reel for projection or for scanning. This is brand new black and white film available at the Film Photography Project store, filmphotographystore.com. And we now offer process and scan services as well. Now note that this brand new film is called reversal film, which means it's a positive. So if you buy or have a vintage projector, you could project this film against the wall. There are lots of cameras out there. Like here is a Kodak brownie fun saver movie camera a brick so to speak and just like the camera we just saw if you open it up same thing empty spool 
your film would go on one side, you thread the camera, shoot it. it, actually says side one, side two. Flip it, shoot it, then send your film out for processing. Here's an example of a film, a regular 8mm film that was recently scanned here at the Film Photography Project. That's it for this video. If you have any questions about Regular 8, please do drop me a line. Michael at filmphotographyproject.com. Thanks so much for tuning in, and we'll see you next time.